finally getting hits. About an hour in or somewhere around there. There we go. Awesome. I just got three poles with uh, slip sinker rigs today, as usual. Fluoro leaders and a mono, mono breakaway leader to the weight. Nice little walleye. I got rosies on these two poles and a uh, night crawler on that rod to see what fish will hit today. Yeah, that's probably like a 14 incher, 14, 14 and a half. A small walleye. You can see the rosy sticking out of his mouth there. Set the pole down. There we go. Yeah, I forgot my uh, my good tape measure. So I have to make do with this one. Yeah, 50 to 60, almost 65 makes them 14 three quarters. Just barely undersized. <sighs> Gotta be 15 to keep. <sighs> there he was. There he is. <laughs> Got them. They're just they're being kind of finicky. They're hitting it every minute if they are hitting it. That was a lot faster than the first fish. That was like five minutes after I caught the last one, which is pretty good for a winter bite. Another decent walleye. This one's probably a legal one. A little bit longer. 15 or so, maybe. Maybe. He's gonna be close. Probably 15 and a quarter, I would guess. Well, he ate it pretty good, but they're, they're not tugging very hard today. That's good that he ate it all the way down. Not just, sometimes, you know, the bite is so, so slow and so, these guys hit it so light that they just, they'll just kind of mouth the end of the, of a minnow if you use it and, and chew it up and then leave it there. And they'll never really get the hook in their mouth unless you're, if you're, if you're lip hooking the minnows. 50 to 65 and a, yeah, he's right around 15 and a half. Awesome. First legal one. Nice little walleye. There we go. Finally. Three hours after last bite or so, another smaller fish on a rosy. Oh, looks like a looks yellow perch. Oh my gosh, it's a huge perch! Whoa, how did that happen? That's a giant perch. Oh my gosh, look how fat it is. That's like may not be the biggest perch I ever caught in my life, but it's one of them. It's got to be like a 14. It's so fat though. It's, it's huge. That's why I figured whenever they let water out, perch seem to come out of the lake and there's some nice perch in the lake. Oh man, I hope you can see him with the light. That is a giant, absolute monster just because of the belly. <laughs> Gotta measure this guy quick. Whoa, slipping. Just take a look at him. Look how tall he is on the back, and the belly's just enormous. Oh man, what a pleasant surprise. Three hours without a bite, and then a giant perch. True jumbo. Alright, 50 to... Yeah, he's only 13 and a half, but he's huge. Definitely over a pound, for sure. I wonder how, I just want to know how tall on the back he is. Like, 
how far his belly sticking out because this is it's so much girth I've caught him much longer or much I've caught him you know a couple inches longer than this but or, or an inch longer or whatever but I don't know if I've ever gotten one quite this fat 46 to 56 he's like I can't even read this thing 60 to yeah he's like four inches tall from the belly to the top of his back at least at least four inches okay I'm done freaking out <laughs> that's a nice perch though that's a beauty oh man